What's up, my boys? We are here in the Bramo crib, Bramo. cooking up some food. What are we gonna cook, my boys? We're gonna make uh, a chicken capsulon or hairdresser. No, we are just gonna call it capsulon. Capsulon. Okay. Buy him. Give capsulon. Yes. But we're gonna make it with rice because we want to be healthy. So uh, ah. I got. So it's a gymnastics recipe, or just a normal people who don't want to get fat recipe. Yeah, pretty much. So I'm also gonna include some eggs because why not? Yeah, boy. Gonna include lots of garlic and peas and veggies and stuff like that. Currently in the pan we have tomatoes, we have peas, we have onions, onions and Philadelphia. And a lot of spices. I don't know spices. What spice did you get? Uh, regular curry. Because I want to give the people everything they can learn from this stuff. Salt, thing. pepper, hot curry, curry and smoked garbage, uh, paprika. Okay. We did. And like this is just our more protein version of sauce. Sorta. Of. You can also use Greek yogurt, but it does give a more yogurty smell. I prefer the cream cheese flavor. So if you're like me, you would probably just put yogurt in there because you don't give a damn about the taste. But if you are like Bram and you can actually cook, then you use that stuff. So there is the rice. rice. Oh my flow is crazy. I can switch that amazing. Oh, oh putting some lemon in that that rice? Like that's that's the stuff I would never do. But this boy, this boy goes the extra mile. You come the what? Do you do the eggs in it? Whoa! Oh! And so the whole game sideways. I've literally never seen anyone put eggs together with rice. That's because nobody does it, because it's kind of weird. Ah, that makes sense. And then instead of regular salad, we're gonna put on the... The, the homemade, yeah, yeah, yeah. So normally there's just like a... Um, like some tomatoes and uh, cucumber. And uh, then they hit and it lettuce with and sauce. Stuff. Yeah. yeah, and then they hit it with sauce. Damn! Going in with the chicken? With More the chicken. protein. To my protein. Everybody knows that like a dog. Protein. Let's eat. Ooh, I'm excited. Ooh, you might remember this place. You probably don't remember the kitchen. But this no. is our Rick and Morty viewing spot. I actually still need to watch the previous episode, man. Okay, boys. Let's talk about the presentation of value. We have some green stuff over here that's definitely uh, plus points. And then uh, we have uh, some food around it, so. Uh, I think uh, presentation wise it definitely deserves a 10 out of 10. Um, what should we watch? I don't know. Hi. Oh my god. This one. Oh look at that video. Oh, wow it's so great. Oh that one must be. Okay boy I'm hyped. Okay let's go. How, how do you get the most out of this recipe? You need to make I, sure. I don't know which way to attack it from. It's basically like a stew so it, it doesn't matter where okay. you attack it from. Oh it's so creamy man. But I think. Also because of the egg. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Comfort food with health benefits, sort of. Gourmet, uh, gourmet cup salon. Yeah, boy. I had a fun time at my boy Bram's place. Right now we're gonna go to sleep. Because tomorrow we have to train again at 9. Which is an hour earlier than during the weekdays. Which is actually pretty weird. Normally in the weekends you can sleep in. So, um, yeah. I will see you guys tomorrow. Charmander, say goodbye. Ah! Boy, you have so much power. You can't change the day. It is the next day. First thing in the morning, right when you wake up, drink a bunch of water. Water is important for your health, boys and girls. Why do I do these stupid voices all the time, man? <clears throat> I mean, they're not even based on anything. I just... Do stupid stuff. Uh, I hate my life. But yeah, water is good for you. And you need it. This is orange and apple and passion fruit flavor. No, I'm just kidding. That was what there was before. And it is. Thing. I can't even English. And it like wakes you up in the morning. I like that about drinking a bunch of water in the morning. Because it wakes you up and it gets you like a little bit. Like what? You know what I mean? But, um, yeah boys, show you this. This is the Netherlands. This is the best part. The best part of the Netherlands. Are you ready? Are you ready, boys? You probably aren't, because... Look at that! Oh my god, it's so good! 
Actually, yesterday when I walked home from my first session, um, it was raining really hard that time, but I really enjoyed it for some reason. I don't know, it's freaking weird. First of all, it couldn't be your fault when his life and mine will fall. It will always be my crown to throw this shade on me Like they all hate on me Don't bring that rage on me Why they throwing shade on me Like they ashamed on me I thought what age are we? Uh -huh. uh, Alright guys, today it's pretty busy in the gym And my coach is uh, also training other gymnasts the small ones. So now I'm just gonna be on my own on the pommel horse, which I actually like just having having a good old time with me and the horse. My favorite apparatus, as you all know. Gonna make it a fun session. Just gonna chill a little bit, do some do some fun skills. See if we can we can get some skills up in here. Make some photos. Actually, uh, you need to follow my Instagram, boys, because this week every day I posted at least one. Pretty cool picture, I think. I, I, I make them with, with my big boy camera. And then I put them on my phone and I put them in my Instagram story. So today it is this picture. So every day I post a cool picture on my Instagram story and probably also just on my Instagram account. So be sure to follow it. The link is in the description. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys there. It's warm outside. And we all want shine. Let you know about it in the city cause they in the crib this time. Whoa. Got pics on the way like the vacay Shoot photo with the AK Got friends by my side Trying to have a great day And I wonder why they throw shades Yeah, but it's all on me Let them roam free Like a European, yeah See me pick up the phone Like I'm trying to haul a home With all the previous ones I got like way too much to that side So with this one I tried to like push way harder with my right arm And I went a little bit more that way And it worked out Only the Russians at the end I didn't know what to do with my hands. Managed to do it though. Yeah. Trying to run away, but I'm not speedy. Need no fake, I just want what's real, and I ride that way till I'm free. That was actually super good. The Woogie on spin super fast, and I like pushed really well with my right arm. Only then I wanted to re grab the, the pommel after the Russians. The Russians were also a little bit sketchy again. I don't know why that is today. I'm just not really getting into the flow of the Russians. But then I wanted to re grab the, the pommel, and I just put my head next to it. And then I scrape my skin off my arm. But that's gymnastics for you, boys. Oh, oh ah, that hurts! Oh my god, pommel horse is so painful. Right, also did the uh, rot into the my dismount. That's gonna be the part after my woogie on. So plan is to do the woogie on, three Russians, and then do the rot into my dismount. And that went pretty well today. It's actually the first time that I did that uh, entire part. So pommel horse is looking pretty good. Pretty good pommel horse session. Pretty normal state of leg hurting and arm. Like we got this one, we got this one. And then we have one on my knee. That one, that one actually hurts pretty bad. You don't see it that much, but it's like went pretty hard. Um, but now we're gonna do some rings. Uh, I'm gonna do the swinging part again. I just need to do like tons of backup rises to planche into my giant because that's a super inconsistent and it gets a lot of deduction because like my um, my planche isn't long enough and it just goes up and down and my hands is like super unstable so we need to do that a ton and I'm not looking forward to it to be honest I just don't like doing rings that much I do like doing some elements but this not so much but you know boys you have to do what you have to do to become a good gymnast and that is what we are going to do Americans the smarties yeah they know that Peanut butter cups, alleen dan klein. Oh ja! It's nice, hè? Ja. It's van Nora. Ja, yeah, it's really nice. Thank you, Nora. No, things are so good. I almost finished the box already.
I'm gonna get so fat. Y'all making me so fat. Oh. Yorian loves these things. I'm I'm sure you will freak out if you see these. The nerds. Yo, I have another surprise for you. I have nerds. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. Fucking vet. Die verkochten ze zelfs bij mij op school in Nijmegen een tijdje. Wow. Yo. <laughs> I want another one. Another, another one. one. I never had these. I thought I had these before, but I don't think I did. So sweet, man. Also a little bit sour. Video games, we're all nerdy about something. We're one group united by our interest and in individuality. I love you better than Say that you love me too We can turn the whole world upside down Cause baby you're the only one for me And it's so it's a journey I need the mango <laughs> So happy today boys, I don't know why I don't know what's up with me, but I am a heavy camper. It's a strong one, we're gonna have some fun today. Just like the other one. <laughs> oh my god! Ah. Arrived at our destination, my parents' house. I don't know why, boys, but I'm so happy. I'm so excited, and I don't know why, and it just it just happened, and can't do anything about it. Sometimes when I'm in the car and like the music is good, I just I'm, uh, I'm afraid that I like pass out because of the excitement and stuff. It is absolutely crazy, and I always like people stare at me like I'm some crazy madman that I'm totally not. I'm I'm totally normal. Maybe a little bit. I don't know, man. Music just hypes me. Up. And it is it is crazy, and some people hate me for it, and some people love me for it. I hope you guys are the second group. But I don't know. And normally I like hip hop music and, and rap and stuff. But I was feeling it, man. I was really feeling some Zac Brown Band country music. It was the album Jekyll and Hyde, I think. I'm not entirely sure. Hello. Coming to greet us. What's up, my boy? Come. Look how weird, like, his, the color of this part of his tail is. Like, he had some, some rash here, so they had to shave it off. And it grew back like an entirely different color than the rest of his hair. It's pretty interesting, if you ask me. Hello, Mamsi. Hello, Mamsi. Mom, I think this is a good moment to end this overexcited vlog. I'd like to thank all of you for watching. And if I did break your eardrums with my screaming, then I would like to personally apologize. Just send me where you are and I will teleport there and I will apologize to you. But you can't hear that because your ears don't work. And I'll, I'll, I'll learn sign language specifically for you. Right? Um, no, but that's the end of the video. Tomorrow we are going to go to Schweinrecht. I'm probably going to vlog that as well. Uh, for a test competition. Um, should be fun. See you in that one. Peace.